Global tensions are at an all-time high. Two world leaders joining forces at the Beijing Olympics. Russian President Vladimir Putin and China's Xi Jinping just wrapping up a meeting saying they're both against NATO's expanding membership or the decision to expand the membership. It's the main reason Russia uh, has reportedly put troops at the Ukrainian border. Joe Khalil is in Washington with breaking news of these developments. Joe, good morning. Yeah, good morning, Adrian. And look, it would be one thing if these two leaders just met. But it wasn't just that. They put out this joint statement together, both condemning, as you said, NATO, the United States and the West, what they see as American expansion and interference into their sort of global sphere of influence. It's something that they uh, have characterized that way. And look, the bottom line is that uh, they actually made an agreement together that they're going to have each other's backs, Vladimir Putin and Xi Jinping will have each other's backs and support each other in their individual tensions against the United States. This is huge news. Anytime your two largest adversaries sort of come together, present a united front like this, and they're using the Beijing uh, Olympic Games and uh, basically the Ukrainian and Russian border situation right now as a stage to do it. The eyes of the world are on that Ukrainian-Russian border where tensions are still high. Obviously, the eyes of the world also on the Olympic Games. So the fact that these two leaders are doing that, there's no real way to sugarcoat this, Adrian. It, it presents uh, a serious security threat for the United States. And the fact that they're doing it together using these global events where you've got a lot of attention, it, it, what it signals is a serious step forward for the China-Russia relationship, something that the United States now is paying very clear attention to. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to click on the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.